Hey guys! So, um, it's been more than a week. I've been slightly off duty to, uh, for a while. Sorry about that. Um, so I'm going to be making a video now! Frickin' wall! <laughs> I'm in a little tight little portion of my room. Oh my god! <laughs> so, I wanted to do another rant video, so we're going to do another cosplayer rant video. Today it's going to be about those wonderful lovelies out there who kind of just they get on my nerves <laughs> don't you just hate it you're in a your costume like I was in my Kyoko cosplay from Madoka Magica and I'm at Anime North and I'm feeling great and a guy comes up to me takes my picture and says you know your costume is really good but you're not wearing contacts so you're not really it's not really great sorry about that Bruh. I have an allergy to contacts. So, like, my eyes will like... <laughs> yeah. So, what? Just because I have one little flaw. It's like, you are my waifu, but you fucked up my waifu. Honey, listen. If you can make an outfit like my Kyoko outfit in two days, hand sewn and have it looking great for Anime North and have like the wig, all that stuff and people are like blown away from your outfit and just have one little flaw. Would you like, <sighs> ah, it's those people that like, as well, like the people who look at you like, you're not cosplaying it right. I can cosplay it better than you, honey. Please, just sit in your little corner. Just sit there. Sit it. Just put your sass and put it in your pocket. Take your sass and put it in your pocket. Like, I really, like, to be honest, I really don't give two shits on a sidewalk about those type of people. But it's the people like that to just kind of like, Mwah. like, I'm stuck there astounded. Like, oh my god. <laughs> like, my Kyoko cosplay is by far one of my favorite costumes of mine uh as well my annie costume but we're not talking about annie because people were actually saying my annie costume was on point so it's just costumes like that where like people can't have like the contacts or the proper uh, like wig color or anything like that and then the people go up to you and nitpick nitpick your costumes just gets me mm, you can't I just can't understand. Like, seriously. Oh, just because of one little flaw. One little flaw. Or the people who are just like, I can cosplay that better. You're too fat for that costume, so I'm gonna cosplay it better than you. Co you, you don't have to cosplay it better than me. Seriously. No, you don't even have to care about cosplaying it better than me. Cosplay is supposed to be fun. Cosplay is supposed to be about you did something and you're excited about it. You love it. But people don't seem to see it that way. <laughs> I'm a little more angry <laughs> than normal. Don't worry about that. It's been a long day for me. <laughs> but it's just, oh, it just, it just gets me angry. Oh my God, my bow's been like kind of weird. <sighs> just, Take your sass, take it, and put it in your pocket. The thumper rule. If you don't got ni nothing nice to say, don't say nothing at all. <sighs> Everyone, like every cosplayer, is fantastic in their own way. If they made their whole outfit out of duct tape, like that is amazing. <laughs> I hand sewed my outfit and people nitpicked it. Like, it... <sighs> If you can hand sew a costume together in like 16 hours, I give you my kudos. Like, even if you machine sew it. Like, <sighs> if you hand sew, sewing machine, buy it online, anything like that, it's fine. And nobody should ever, ever nitpick it because of that. It's the nitpickers. I hate nitpicking. I hate it. Though I know at times, even I do it myself. 
but I don't say it out loud. No, I... How awful would that be if somebody walked up to you and just openly stated, Oh, your outfit would look better like this. Or, it's good and all, but because of this one uh, uh, thing that's missing in your costume, I'm going to hate it. It's, uh, it's kind of like when I did, uh, like, any of my costumes that have characters with other eyes, eye colors. People get a little nitpicky about it because of my blue eyes. But seriously, I have an allergy. <laughs> I can't do anything about it other than Photoshop. But I don't have Photoshop on my computer. Wah wah. But it's just, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a really short episode because it's mostly just me trying to vent out. Um, as well, it's an update video. I am currently sick still. Um, as well, I'm slightly, slightly, uh, I, it's usually this season, I usually get a little sadder than usual. Um, but I got Cooking Mama 4 for like 99 cents. <laughs> I'm getting video games for like 99 cents. <laughs> Where I got it? Shh, it's a secret. <laughs> Real Canadian Superstore. Shh, it's a secret. <laughs> but like, uh. No, I've been kind of lethargic and apathetic about the whole thing of uh, YouTube videos at the moment, but I'm trying to come back to it. Uh, I'm cleaning up my room because I'm getting new windows in the next couple days. So like pressure has to get off the Ooh, arm. Pressure has to get off there. Uh, I'll pick them off sometime. Uh, as well, I got, I'm, I'm putting all my pop figurines out. Uh, I, uh, but yeah, I'm slowly getting better. Uh, videos will be slower than usual, but it's gonna be okay. This summer, it's gonna be great. I'm going to be getting more of my YouTube videos out. I'm gonna have more editing processing and stuff. <clears throat> I'm dying. <laughs> no, um, I'm gonna have more of my editing stuff. Uh, I'm going to be editing more of my stuff. Uh, bleh. Sorry, wording. Words can't word today. So yeah, so this is just a slight rant, slight update. Um, uh, nitpicking people. I'm just, mm, I mean, mm, mm. Anyways, uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. In our next video. Episode, video, videos. <laughs> see you guys. Bye. <laughs>